Okay. There we go. That was pretty good. <laughs> we took uh, a lot better than I uh, thought we would be able to. Yeah. Uh, so we have a randomized Soul Link Nuzlocke happening here today. Uh, so what we have randomized are the starters, uh, wild encounters, trainers, uh, TMs, and random items. Like any every item on the ground is going to be a random item. Uh, ranging from anything good to just being male. So hopefully we don't get lots of mail. Um, that's about it, right? Yeah, so uh, this can be a soul link. So uh, every time uh, we get new Pokemon, they're going to be linked together. If mine dies, Steven's dies. Good old Dewey Gooey. <laughs> gooey Dewey. It's Gooey Dewey now. You are right. <laughs> Well, anyway, yeah, Drunken Panda is my, my roommate, and, uh, yeah, we haven't really played any games together in a while, so hopefully we can get along during this. <laughs> I think we'll be able to do good. Alright. Okay, so, I guess he's gonna be voicing all the girl characters. Oh, and, uh, oh crap, we didn't talk about it. Did you want to do the thing that Mr. Fruit's doing with, like, the typing? Um... You know what? Yeah, let's give it a shot. Yeah, so so the thing is, uh, we can't have duplicate uh, primary typing on any Pokemon. Um, so that means if I have an electric type, I can't get another electric type, and Drunken Panda can't have a electric type as well. And that goes with every single typing. Uh, so we're going to probably miss a bunch of encounters because of this. Should make it for a nice, challenging, fun experience. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, and we'll probably argue over who, uh, of how to have team placement because of it, so... Hopefully, hopefully that's a good time. Alright, so do you want to be the boy or the girl? Uh, I'm, I'm gonna be the boy. <laughs> okay, so this would be what is called Twilight, wouldn't it? I'm seeing if you have still have the same text as I do. Sorry to keep you waiting. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. My name is Professor Oak, but everyone calls me the Pokemon Professor. Before we go any further, I'd like to tell you a few things uh, you should know about this world. This world is widely inhabited by creatures known as Pokemon. There's, there's a uh, Azumarill. We humans live alongside Pokemon as friends. At times we play together and at other times we work together. Some people use their Pokemon. I don't think we talked about the Nuzlocke rules, but it's just standard Nuzlocke rules. Um, one encounter per area. When they're dead, they're dead. Um, when they're dead, they're dead. Uh, I guess we'll be nicknaming them. Is is uh, we gonna be cute like that? Uh, but some people use their Pokemon to battle and develop closer bonds with them. Now, why don't you tell me a little bit about yourself? Are you a boy or are you a girl? So you're gonna be the boy, right? Won't you please tell me? You're gonna be the boy, but you're gonna voice all the girls. And I'll be the girl and I'll voice all the dudes. So you're a girl then. Yes. Please tell me your name. Okay. I'm gonna be Dewey. Dewey. I'm gonna be good old panda. Let's see, Loa. Two. So you're gonna be a savage and go all caps, huh? Always. <laughs> I yell my name. <sighs> my name is Dewey. Yes. Dewey, are you ready? Your very own tale of grand adventure is about to unfold. Fun experiences, difficult experiences. There's so much waiting for you. Dreams, adventure. Let's go to the world of Pokemon. I'll see you later. Oh man, you're already in the bedroom? Right. I'm always in my bedroom, you know that. <laughs> or on the couch. Wait, what? Do <laughs> you don't have any? Oh, Ethan. Ethan. Ethan sent me mail. Oh, okay. Thank you, Ethan. Uh, he loves Pokemon. He didn't give me any items though. Did you get an item? I, I didn't care about the mail. But usually, I see people always open their PC at the beginning of a game, and they're like, "OMG." We got a uh, mail, and it's a potion. Hi, Panda. You're finally awake. 
Your friend Lyra was just here. She was playing hide and seek with her Meryl. Oh, I almost forgot. Our acquaintance Professor Elm was looking for you. He said he had a favor to ask of you. You know where the lab is, right? It's right next door to us. By the way, do you have everything you need to go out? Here, use this bag to carry things. Oh. This is your trainer card. Mom gave us a purse. Here, you can save your record of your progress. These are also rather helpful. Just try touching the buttons, and you'll know what to do in no time. I Thanks, can never Mom. find the buttons to push. Right? <laughs> These Game Boy Advances, uh, I mean, uh, DSs are so, so yeah. tricky. Yeah. <sighs> Two screens? Uh oh. oh What's that Meryl doing? Little Meryl. Oh, that's an Azuma roll. I don't remember playing this one. Did we play this one? Like, on DS, like back in the day? Um, Oops. Man, the professor wants us to go somewhere. Where are you going? I went out to the road. Do you want to come out here? There's a girl talking to me. What do you think you're doing? <laughs> well, I can see it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, Panda! What do you think you're doing? <laughs> it's dangerous to go out without a Pokemon while Pokemon jump out of the grass on the way to the next town. Oh. This tricky little girl. Oh, we were supposed to go in here all along. Alright, so I gotta read all the scientists because I think all the scientists are dudes on this game. Okay. Hi, Dewey. I've been waiting for you. Do you know anything about my research? As you know, Pokemon are carried in Pokeballs these days, but before the Pokeball was invented, people used to walk with Pokemon, just like your friend Ethan does. Pokeballs are great because you can carry many Pokemon, but walking with Pokemon must have some advantages. It could have something to do with how Pokemon grow or evolve. So I'm going to give you a Pokemon. Can you walk beside this Pokemon, outside of its Pokeball, to see if this brings any special feelings or bonds between Pokemon and people? The device over there has some Pokemon you could choose from. Oh. Is he getting a phone call? Oh, hey! I got an email. Professor Elm. Uh, <laughs> okay. Hey, listen. I have this acquaintance that people call Mr. Pokemon. He keeps finding weird things and raving about his discoveries. I just got an email from him saying that this time it's real. It's probably another Pokemon egg, but we're still so busy with our... This is the first eggs in the game, right? Because there's no eggs in Gen 1, technically. Well, yeah. I mean, yeah. Yeah. No. yeah. yeah, there was no breeding. Yeah, okay, so this is the first egg ever touched. But we're still so busy with our Pokemon research. Wait, you know, you can go in our place, right? Can we count on you? You can choose one of the Pokemon over there. Okay. So these are going to be randomized, just like everything in the game. But uh, before we go ahead, I wanted to put on a uh, set mode. You know how to do that? I'm trying to remember. Options. Options, yeah. I put my text speed on fast and uh, battle style set. That sound good? Sounds good to me. Cool. Go ahead and confirm that and then... We gotta get ready to uh, check out our Pokemon. Already? Are you ready? I'm ready. Okay, three, two, one, go! Okay. Okay, so. What? It's a goon! Okay, so what's. Oh, <laughs> I got a drowsy in the first slot. So, uh, <laughs> let's go to the uh, right. To the right? And see okay. What's in the next. Right. Send a quill. Um, a hey, Lumatone. A Lumatone. Hmm, not bad. Oh, God. Okay, you ready? Yep. Three, two, one. A Fero. Oh, Ooh. man. Rampardos. I, I get this. That's pretty sweet. Um, uh, how do we want to do this? <laughs> I will tell you I, I mean, don't mind Drowsy. But uh, this is also both of us, our first Pokemon Nuzlocke. So this <laughs> I don't know. Lumatone's not a bad Pokemon. Uh, oh, he, I God. Mean, he's pretty defensive, but he. 
he does learn some pretty sweet moves, but I mean, come oh. on. Oh. Yeah, because I mean, Cyndaquil, I think Drowsy might even be stronger than Cyndaquil technically early on. I could be completely wrong. I feel like you gotta go Suicune and Drowsy. Their souls are linked. You wanna do it? Uh, yeah, let's do it. I'm gonna be <laughs> greedy. This is my, okay, greed, right. <laughs> my greed choice. Don't you ever get that Drowsy killed. Oh killed. god. Well, thing is, it probably will die. So <laughs> drowsy. Okay. All right. So nickname, yes. Okay. Drowsy. Uh. Uh. I need my drowsy. Uh. Uh, Eeyore, because I think Eeyore is an elephant. I think Drowsy is an elephant. I don't really know. I mean, you know, he's got a trunk. He's got a big, long trunk nose. He's got something. Eeyore. Probably spelling Eeyore wrong, because... I don't... I don't really know how to spell Eeyore. In fact, it looks weird, because I, uh... I have the caps all weird. Alright. Eeyore! This one's for, uh... Foxy. <laughs> Alright. Eeyore! Uh, that's the nickname for my Drowsy. So the Nuzlocke still hasn't started because we don't have Pokeballs, right? Correct. It doesn't okay. officially start until we have the Pokeballs. Okay, you can take it all the way to Mr. Pokemon's house. If your Pokemon gets hurt, you should heal it with this machine. So we can come back over here and heal before we get to the, like, the nearest Pokemon Center. It's so easy to use. Just check the PC on my desk. Uh, Mr. Pokemon goes everywhere and finds rarities. His house is past Cherry Grove City. Go north, a little past Cherry Grove. I'm counting on you, Dewey. Alright, so I got a Drowsy. You got a freaking seat, Sweet Coon following you. I want you to have these to help you with your task. Okay, sweet. Ooh. Got potions. Man, I love when right. people give us free stuff. Yep. Thank you, Mr. Scientist. Okay. So I'm gonna try not to get an encounter here in the first grass because uh we can't catch it. <laughs> but <laughs> so, if we do, it's okay. So Ethan is talking. Gotta try to make sure we don't over level. Yeah. Well, Panda. We should... Oh, okay. So you picked a Suicune. Slash Drowsy. That's a cute Pokemon you have. When you walk with it, it'll become more friendly. You should turn around and talk to it sometimes too. Oh, that's right. Why don't you show it to your mom? See ya. <laughs> mom, Ooh. mom, look! Professor gave me a Suicune! The coolest Pokemon in this gen. I'm so spoiled. <laughs> mom, the professor hates me. He gave me a drowsy. <laughs> oh, Panda, that's a cute Pokemon you have. Professor Elm must have given it to you. Oh, Professor Elm has a task for you, you say? What kind of task? I see. That sounds a little difficult, but when someone at makes that kind of request of you, it must be important. Oh, that's right. I completely forgot. Your Poke Gear came back. Woohoo! From the repair shop. Here you go. Panda received the Poke Gear. Woohoo! Uh. The Pokemon Gear of Poke Gear, as it's often called, is what every trainer should have. Guess what? You can use the Poke Gear to make a phone call too. Do you remember oh. how? Actually, uh, yes, I do remember how. So I'm not going to go into that. Just power <laughs> off the Poke Gear and touch the telephone button, okay? She's so telling you anyway. People you can call will automatically be registered. Just select one of the to give him or her a call. Wow, I can't believe it's so easy to make a phone call. Okay, mom, it's time to time to go. I'm a big boy. I got a sweet coon. Uh, me and Foxy <laughs> will kill everything. Oh, wait, have you looked at the, uh, what kind of, what kind of moves it has? Ooh, I oh, because we have yet. randomized, uh, abilities. Careful nature. I have pound and hypnosis on this drowsy. Ooh, what mild you got? Nature. Mild nature? Somewhat of a... Uh, water veil prevents the Pokemon from getting a burn. Ooh, that's useful. Oh, I have Hypercutter prevents the attack stat from being lowered. Uh, I mean, probably won't come in handy except early on when everything's using like Leer on me or Tail Whip. Yeah. Well, I don't even. Yeah. 
All right, well, you ready to head off to the dude to get the egg? Oh, uh-oh. Wait a, wait one second. Professor Elm's talking to me. Oh no. Yeah. See, I'm waiting for you to catch up. There you go. What's going on, Professor Elm? Are we in trouble? I almost completely forgot about this. Here, I'll give you my number. He's a kitten on me. I'm a little girl, man. <laughs> I'll call you if anything comes up. If he's uh, if he's ready to get it on, like late at night. I'm just kidding. That's disgusting. All right. All right. So Route 29 West. Okay, this game has the routes all funky. Anyway, if we get an encounter right here, it doesn't count yet. We get to come back to this, right? Correct. All right. So I'm gonna try not to get an encounter, because if I run into anything out here, I Probably gonna die. Um, whoops. Oh no. No item down there? Okay. I know, uh, in regular gold version, there's like Geodudes and Jigglypuffs. Oh no, an encounter. Must avert my eyes. Ooh, there's Piplups out here for me. Wait, Piplup? Piplup's like Gen wow. 4. Oh my god. Isn't it? I wonder if this randomizer put. All sorts of crazy stuff in. Well, I'm gonna kill this guy because I probably need the XP for my drowsy. Um, yeah, I'm gonna just kill this as well. I'm not too worried about becoming too okay. Never mind. I just one shot this week. Cascoon. I mean, You suicided already. Ah, uh, yes. This looks <laughs> uh, promising. Golly, how much XP I did really you get from I'm that? Uh, hardly any. Okay. Be careful. Oh, man. I knew it. Oh, man. We got, like, encounters at the same time again. Oh, we got... Ooh, oh, Lux oh. oh, wow, dude. Zang this is so much more fun than just running into Sentret and Hoot Hoots in the beginning. Okay. Level 3. I'm gonna I'm a run from this guy. Same. I don't know if I can take him. I'm just fear fearing that Foxy's bloodlust is gonna be <laughs> too great and kill a lot of stuff. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, this is this old guy? He gives us a map, if I remember correctly. Yes. You're a rookie trainer, aren't you? <laughs> I can tell. That's okay. Everyone is a rookie at some point. If you'd like, I can teach you a few things. Okay, then follow me. Don't have a choice. You gotta follow the old man around town. So fast. Oh, Holy I'm sorry. Shit, I forgot that you weren't wearing the, uh, try to go as as possible, so keep, uh, keep, uh, uh I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> this is a Pokemon Center, see all your Pokemon in no time at all. You'll be relying on them a lot, so you better learn about them. Oh, oh. This is a Pokemon Mart, and they sell Pokeballs for catching wild Pokemon and other useful items. Yep, so we're teaching all you newbies how to play here as well. Route 30 is out this way, trainers will be battling their Pokemon there. If you go a little further, oh, did they start at Route 29? Because that's where Kanto ends at 28. I'm guessing. Could be wrong. I guess. You know, if you go I'm a little further, really yeah. Because don't the most of the new ones just start at Route One? Yeah. I don't know though. Yeah, because I know this one. At least this is like one of the few games where you can actually go to the other uh, island. Mm -hmm. This is the sea, as you can see. Some Pokemon are found only in water. Uh, I'm getting tired. Oh, you got kids. Uh. Making me show you around town. old man should give us uh, the, them running shoes, you know. He don't need yeah. them anymore. <laughs> Here, here's my house. For effort, keep me up with the alley in my running shoes. Oh, well, they're still warm. <laughs> oh, God, you yeah, I Don't worry. These are brand new. Uh, I changed my oh, voice for that guy towards the end there. Shoes. Yeah. Touch the sprint button on the touch screen to sprint. Ooh, that's how they get you. I can't quite touch my touch screen at all times. Or hold the B button down to sprint. I think I can do that. But can my drowsy keep up with me? I highly doubt it. Oh, he's keeping up. All right, uh, I'm gonna go heal because I'm a I'm a cautious dude. And uh, I lost like two PP on pound, so you know I might need to be able to pound something here in a bit. Uh. Tsh Pretty sure we won't get Pokeballs until we deliver the egg to Elm. 
But I'm gonna go to the Pokemart and yeah, no. No items at the Pokemart. Of course. Alright. You ready to head up route like 30? Uh oh. Oh! <laughs> I made it! I'm talking to the old dude again up here. I forgot about one thing. This is another token from me. Take it! The guy gent loaded the map guard onto. Oh, that's the net. Like, okay. Poke Gear can now show the town map. Okay, select the Poke Gear on the touch screen and then select the town map icon. You'll see the map of the region you're currently in. Poke Gear becomes more useful as you add cards. Okay. I mean, I rarely look at that stuff. I think I didn't even look at the map like the first time I played through the game. Oh, we got an item up here. You got an item? Yeah. To the right? Yeah. No, I got an encounter. Ooh, I got a deep sea scale. All right. I feel like you're running into some pretty decent Pokemons out here. Uh, this is a new route. Yeah, it is a I'm new route. I'm going to uh, run for now. I just need to... Uh... Oh. Yeah, I'm if you're very unlucky. Are you kidding me? Oh my lord. Well, you have a chance to get a Mew on this route. Once we get Pokeballs. So that's is, cool. I don't I don't necessarily want all these crazy ones because I'm not going to be able to catch them with just five Pokeballs. <laughs> that's true. So that Suicune is a good freebie because you didn't have to try to catch it. All right. He's up in the house, right? He's up. Uh, I think he's past his house. That sounds well, wrong, I'm gonna go but... in this house. Yeah, I'm going in. It's some people who are just going to my house looking for Mr. Pokemon. So, yeah, see, he knows. You did mean to visit my house, right? Uh, how kind of you? Do you have any Rapcorns? Oh, this Apricorn, dude. Tree bears fruit once a day. I have one of those trees, too. Apricorns are really something you can make Pokeballs and other things. They are quite useful. I have a feeling this is meant to be. I'm so happy that I'll give you this. I got an Apricorn box. I forgot that. You can make Pokeballs with it's the Apricorns? Ap yeah, it's Apricorns Be instead of Decent Apricorn. Well, there's berries and then there's apricorns. Oh, they have both in this one. Yeah. Oh, did you just get an apricorn from that tree? Yes. Oh, okay. Sick. Okay, I got a green as well. Ah! You made it through? Yep. You shouldn't be too far up ahead. Ooh, I found a hard stone. Let's see what I got here. Actually, reminds me. I, I got a figgy not... berry! Look what I got. Okay. All so. right. I don't think. Is this already a new route? Oh, okay. No. Okay. Oh. Please. Growlithe out here. I mean, decent. Get away. Growlithe. Are you kidding me? I think we all know who's going to have the uh, powerhouse team over here. <laughs> I mean, on this route, you have Mew, Typhlosion, uh, Gliscor or something like that. Yeah, Gliscor. Yeah. A little tree out here for me to get some Apricorns from. It's a yeah, pink Apricorn. Time, this is uh, terrifying for both of us because these catch rates are going to be rough. Oh, yeah, because if you can't catch, I can't catch. <laughs> it, uh, must be Dewey and Panda. It was I who sent an email to Professor Elm earlier. Oh, they have email now. Wow. I didn't realize. Yeah, you don't have to sit there going back and forth delivering yeah. them, you know? This, this is what I want Professor Elm to examine. Let's take a look at this egg. It's, like, it's crazy how this is like the first egg after like living with Pokemon for... A millennia baffled yeah <laughs> they're like pokemon have sex when they're at the daycare and they make these is that what's happening <laughs> do we put the mystery egg in the key items pocket a friend of mine from ecruti gave it to me i bet you can't find that kind of egg in johto i thought professor elm might be able to uh figure out what it is he's the best when it comes to the research of pokemon evolution that's a quote from the famous professor oak you're returning to professor elm here your pokemon should have some rest Thank you. I don't think we'll get the Pokeballs yet. Oh, Professor Oak. He just popped up. 
And with that, I'm Professor Oak, a Pokemon researcher. So you're doing? I was just visiting my friend, Mr. Pokemon. I heard you were running an errand from Professor Elm, so I waited here. Oh, what's this? A rare Pokemon. <laughs> Drowsy, I see. You must be helping Professor Elm's research. I think I understand why Professor Elm gave you that Pokemon. You will treat your Pokemon with love and care, it seems. Ah, you seem to be dependable. How would you like to help me out? See, this is the latest version of the Pokedex. It automatically records data on Pokemon you've seen or caught. It's a high-tech encyclopedia. I'd like you to have it. Oh, thank you, Professor El Oak. Go meet many kinds of Pokemon and complete that Pokedex. But I've stayed too long. I have to get to Goldenrod for my usual radio show. I have a feeling that this is not the last time we'll meet. Let's encounter an exchange of numbers just to be on the safe side. Oh, sweet. We got a bunch of old dudes' phone numbers. Alright, so back to Professor Elm. Alright, who's calling? Yes. <gasps> oh, Lord. Hello, Dewey and Panda! It's a disaster! Oh, it's just terrible. What should I do? Oh, no! Let's get back here now! Oh, yeah, we got robbed. Or, uh, yes. I should have said spoiler alert, we got robbed. We got robbed. Head back. Should be quicker to get back. Ow, oh, man! Wow, the timing on that encounter for both of us. Uh, oh, dude, ooh, what's with geez. the legendary raid oh, on here? Oh, my lord! <laughs> Let's hope that uh, I don't get one shot by this guy as I try to run away. Don't escape! No! Oh wait, you know it's okay. Le Nuzlocke hasn't started yet. Oh, he did four damage. Weak. Zapdos is weak. Level four. <laughs> he had Thunder Shock though at level four. Yeah, well, Thunder Shock is the weak one. It's, it's, it's still electric move, move though. Yeah. yeah, it's it's definitely a good move to have. So I got Growlithe and freaking Zapdos up here. You got Mew and Typhlosion. So, I mean, we Gligor. should be Gligor. You should be all right. <laughs> if we could get him. No, you're beating me. I'm waiting for you over here. I'm there. But back to the egg thing. It's like, uh... Dang it. Did people just, oh like, crap, walk I didn't heal! Oh no. Oh wait, but it's okay. We don't have Pokeballs yet. I keep getting scared. <laughs> you, you got a Pokemon at the lab. What a waste. That's a Pokemon that's too good for a wimp like you. Don't you get what I'm saying? Well, I do have a good Pokemon. I'll show you what I mean. Oh no. Alright, here's... Uh, I usually name this guy, like, Assface or something. <laughs> so... <laughs> so. Passerby boy. He has the Ramparados in the same Oh. Way. Oh, he has the Fero for you. Okay. Yeah. That's not bad for me. Uh, I feel for you. Should I try to hit a hypnosis on this guy? I feel like I could totally win if I get a. Ooh. Okay. Well. You use Leer on me. Hold it. I'm gonna oh. bite my way through this Fero. I'm gonna die. He just wants to growl at me. He's leering oh at me. My, I used hypnosis three times and it's missed three times, so I probably could have killed this guy by now if I would just pound him. Oh, I finally put him to sleep. If he ever wakes up though and decides to hit you, uh, uh, rip. <laughs> now, should I try to actually win this? I'm gonna try to Always. actually win this. I uh, gotta use a potion then. Survive, Eeyore, I don't even want you to get... I don't want your blood to be tainted by a loss ever. Even though it's a freebie. Alright, let's do two damage with this pound. Come on! Get a crit. This is bad. I mean... is He's used Leer like six times on me, I'm gonna get one shot when he actually attacks. <laughs> Come on shouldn't be uh effect anymore but that doesn't matter it's still lowering it, defense wow it hasn't said but it failed or whatever yet he's still doing leer you have a chance i do it's it's looking bleak but 
There's a the headbutt. Here's the one shot. <laughs> you just wanted me to think I had a chance. You're. <laughs> well, I wanted out. Well, like I said, it doesn't count yet. At least, unless I had. Until we get those pokeballs. Ah. Do you want to know who I am? You just made quick work of that freaking dude, huh? That Firo? Oh, yeah. Yeah. I'm going to be the world's greatest Pokemon trainer! Oh, what a meanie head. Give it back! That's my trainer card! Oh no! You saw my name? <laughs> we all know your name. It's been ass face since I was in third grade. <laughs> Alright, do I need a heal? Yes. Ah, oh, I'm good. Uh... I'm at full health because I, I wanted it out. No. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. Didn't mean to run into that grass. Woohoo, let's go. Professor Elm, give us some Pokeballs. You make Ooh, it. A C dot. Oh, C dot. I used C dot once on uh, Gen 3. It's weird, because I thought this was just the first 250 Pokemon, but I was horribly mistaken. I'm over at, uh, the Prof. Yeah, I'm coming. Is your building a different color than mine on the outside? Oh, okay. Oh. Who are you? We are investigating the case of the missing Pokemon here. Rule number one. Whoever did it will come back to the site. Oh my, so you must be the one who did it. Right, we got some smart cops up in here, man. Hold on a second! She has nothing, and he has nothing to do with it! I saw it! There was a red-haired boy looking into the building. Okay. Oh. What? You battled a boy like that? He must be the one who did it. Did you happen to get his name? Uh, I'm gonna keep you PG, and I'm just gonna name him Butthead. Because, uh... When I put ass face into text, it seems a lot more vulgar. Oh, yeah. It seems more vulgar if I do that, so... Um, I don't know. What are you naming your guy? Uh, butt face. Okay. We'll, we'll keep it, uh, the same here. <laughs> uh, head, H-E-D, cause... Butt fack? Yeah. Butt fack? <laughs> that sounds even dirtier, though. <laughs> but, he was a butt fack! <laughs> okay. I see, so Butthead and Buttfack was his name. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah, that was just... <laughs> like, the cops still taking us serious after, like, it was Butthead. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for helping my investigation. Your next assignment is to search for this red-haired individual. Wait, did you say my call assignment? Call him by is? his name. Yeah, call him Butthead and Butt Butthead Buttfack. Do you want to talk as Lyra? Yes, or whatever? Uh... <laughs> they understand who you are oh you're innocent <laughs> see you later okay oh those pigtails <laughs> dewey this is terrible oh yes what was mr pokemon's big discovery uh he found out that pokemon do it and they produce eggs and they fertilize the eggs with pokey semen <laughs> <laughs> this is an an egg isn't it this egg, and uh, also all Pokemon love to do it with dittos. This egg must be something I've never seen. Still, it's just an egg. Mr. Pokemon is always fascinated by eggs. Well, since he gave it to us, we might as well find out what secret it holds. I'll keep it for a while to find out about the egg. Uh, what? Oak gave you a Pokedex? Is that true? That's incredible. He is a superb at seeing the potential of people as trainers. Dewey, I knew you were a little different. Things are going to be fun. Your Pokemon seem to really like you, so why don't you take the Pokemon Gym Challenge? If you manage to defeat all the gym leaders, you'll eventually challenge the Pokemon League champion. Or not. <laughs> or we'll die along the way. Becoming the champion is not at all easy, but you can certainly challenge Violet City's gym. Uh, before we go there, I'll, we'll look up the level cap for this highest level guy, and we won't exceed that, right? Uh, challenging the gym scattered around will be a long journey. Before you leave, make sure that you talk to your mom. Can I leave without talking to my mom? 
I'm sure she doesn't care that much about me. Yep, you can leave without talking to your mom if you want to. Wait! Do we still not get Pokeballs? The heck, dude? I'm talking to mom. Oh, okay, okay, I talked to mom. Yeah, good idea. Good idea. I just remember mom wanted me to save money. Oh, yeah. Sorry. Uh, but I'm not going to do that. All, all this money is going to be mine. <laughs> so you're looking on an adventure. Okay, I hope to. But what can I do for you? I know. Every time you receive prize money, I'll save some for you. <laughs> on a long journey, money's important. Do you want me to save your money? Absolutely not, Mom. I'm a responsible kid, and I will not just buy candy. I mean, you're 10 years old. You're practically a grown-up. Friends, when you work as a team, you can accomplish anything. Now, go on. Gosh, Mom, you're so responsible. Oh, just... yeah. She knows you have a, su a Suicune, man. Suicune is better than any dad you could ever have. Oh, we still don't have... Doesn't one of the... Oh, I think someone's going to stop us to teach us how to catch something, right? And then we'll get Pokeballs? Yes. Okay. Lyra's here to stop me. Oh, okay. Ethan. Ethan's up here with his Meryl. There you are. Panda, you can catch wild Pokemon with Pokeballs. Follow Woo me. Woohoo. Oh, no. Let's go. Uh, in case you didn't notice, I have a Suicune, so... Uh, I don't really need I don't, anything. I, I, don't, I don't need anything else, okay? You don't need to show me how to catch a Rattata. Just like that. Huh? Was that too fast? I'll try again. Come this way. What in the world? Did she already... Oh, wow. The cutscene's different for you. From the text. Oh. Well, I mean, it was at least, like... At least she, like, joked around a bit. Ethan was straight to business. Either that or I was just smashing A or a lot or something. <laughs> I like how they do it, like, pretty slow, like, pretty slow, they go through all the menus, like, as if this game isn't just smashing the A button. <laughs> feel bad for her, for her Nuzlocke, all she gets is a rat attack. Oh, in the beginning. Well, at least one day she'll get eradicate. Hopefully. See? Just like that! Better to lower your target's HP more than I did. Or make it sleep or something. You can try all kinds of things. <laughs> See what works. I'll give you these. Good luck! We have Pokeballs. our Pokeballs. The Nuzlocke has officially begun. Now, everything. Now we're in danger. Yes, now we're in danger of the bloodlust of Foxy. <laughs> All right, do you want to get an encounter right here? Of course. Woo! I don't know what that is. Oh, a hippopotamus? Well, I got a star you. I think I can handle the star you and not kill it. And I can put it to sleep. Ooh, it almost half damage. In fact, if I crit, I'll kill this guy. Are you going to one-shot him? No. Okay, okay. I'll but throw a ball. I throw a ball right here. Him again. You might be able to, but there's just a good chance you'll crit. I'm going to Pokeball this Staryu. Now, wait, wait, I can't use the Staryu. You can't of your use Staryu. Yeah. But, but it's good to have his backups. We'll have him as backup. If you catch your Hippopotamus. Staryu! Alright, alright, we got backups! Uh, nickname Staryu, yes. Dumb nickname, probably every other Staryu owner has named a Staryu Patrick. Patrick. Patrick the Staryu! Let's and go. I'm gonna name this Hippopotas Jimmy. Jimbo. Hmm, I like Jimbo better. Okay. <laughs> uh, there's a computer at Prof Professor Elms, right? Yes. I gotta drop him off. Oh. Got to drop him off. Uh, 
Well, we have... Well, I don't know. We might have to go to the Pokemon Center. I think it's just healing. Just healing, right? Mm-hmm. All right. Well, don't use your... Hippopotatus Jimbo. All right, so we're probably going to get the next encounter, right? And then probably call it right there. Oops. For today. Well, let me uh, go ahead and slay whatever this is. Oh, C dot. C dot. Got whoopers out here. Oh, we didn't mention it, but uh, if we get shinies, we'll catch shinies, right? I mean, yeah. I doubt it's going to happen. The shiny claws. Yeah, and... we'll do a shiny claws. We we just can't use them if we've already <coughs> caught. And then the dupes. I mean, dupes claws. Uh, so dupes claws actually works for uh, both of us if it's something you already have. Oh, okay. We get a yes. re-encounter, right? We don't just miss out. Correct. Cool. But I want a sweet coon. That means I'll never get a sweet coon. Foxy is all mine. She has oh, no other master. Man, oh man. Well, let's go get you a Mew. <laughs> oh god. You didn't go you didn't make it to the next route yet, right? Not yet. I'm gonna drop off my uh Star You. Go ahead and drop you off Star You. See that's a big rip. Like we can't even use our first catches. Uh, but they're still alive. Maybe I'll be able to use them when this uh, drowsy dies. So should I just throw and get this drowsy killed so I can use that star? You? <laughs> just uh, kidding. Absolutely not. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! My dude is green. Oh no! My dude is green. Uh oh. Uh oh. I'm just running into all the encounters right now. Uh oh. I'm a little bit scared. Because at this very moment, my screen is black. My top screen is black. Please don't be broken. Please don't be broken, game. Why is... Huh. Have you tried moving around? <laughs> Yeah, I, as soon as I left the Pokemon Center, my dude turned green. My DS is freaking out. Well, you didn't run into anything new yet, right? Are you like farming yeah. XP out there or what? What the heck are you doing? I'm trying to get to the next town and I just keep running into a oh. through town. Oh, you're, you're sprinting, huh? Mm-hmm. Okay. Well, when you, yeah. Well, I'm going to have to call it right here because I can't I have to figure this screen out. Mm-hmm. I don't know what happened. I'll get to the town and then save. Yeah, so we'll be back eventually with another episode. Maybe if this uh, ROM didn't, or I mean, not this ROM, if this game, this Nintendo DS didn't break on me, um, we'll be able to play some more. If my cartridge, my little, my game works still, we'll be able to keep going. So. Yeah, so okay, if you, everybody. Yeah. Till next time. <laughs>